first of all, talk about your look. Who are you yes. wearing this evening? Uh, Michael Kors. Kors. Yes. Beautiful. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Does a moment like this, given that you're now a mom, being out at a premiere, does it hit you a little different? As in which which way? Like, do you feel bad that you're here? Do you miss her? Like, oh no, I don't feel bad that I'm here. I love her, but I also I'm excited to be out. Um, she's also asleep and has no idea where I am right now. Um, no, I we're very lucky. We have a lot of help enabling me enabling me to come out tonight and and support this show that I love so much. So I'm so proud to be here. So many cast members that we talked to this evening, truly, Kaylee, have talked about how wonderful you are. Aww. Folks have said it was the best set experience I've ever had because of how you cared for people, how you encouraged people, how you would say great take, how you bought folks Del Taco. <laughs> Pregnant Kaylee is awesome. I brought everyone down with me. I, I ordered a lot of bad stuff and made everyone eat it with me because who's going to make the sad pregnant woman eat Del Taco by herself? Um, yeah, we had a lot of fun food orders. Um, I loved the cast so much. I was always very worried about them, how they were feeling. If we, if we was like the coldest winter, sorry, the coldest winter of all time that L.A. has had. And all the, this whole show is supposed to take place outside at the beach. And everyone was so cold. And so I was always very worried about them keeping warm. And we were ordering blankets and hand you know the little heat pockets and that was my concern on this show for my for my girls yeah. and I also heard that in one of the scenes young Matilda tried to kick her way out oh my god I was doing a scene with Everett Carradine we were in the bathroom and she was standing very close to me and at one and I got such a big kick and of course I'm trying I'm getting kicked all the time so I didn't even say anything she jumped and I was like did you see that she's like yeah, it was almost like an alien was like coming out so that was her moment the last time we talked during the junket, we talked about how the Jonas Brothers put her to sleep. But now I saw a new post, and she's in an in sync onesie. No, it's really she just jumping from boy band to boy band. She can't decide who her favorite is at this point. Um, she's testing it out. She seems to like the in sync apparel. Um, and we are on the search for a Jonas Brothers onesie. I have not found one yet. I looked on Amazon. Why is there not a Jonas Brothers onesie? Um, but if if there is one, we will find it, and she will wear it. We talked to Tom a couple weeks ago, um, and he talked about how I asked him how being a dad has changed him. He said, I cry a lot more. Tom cries a lot. Yes, we both cry a lot. Yeah, we do. You just kind of you look at her, and you're like, how? first of all, we're, I think we're crying because we're shocked it's ours. And we're like, this is ours, and we, we get to keep it forever, and we're just so happy. And it's, it's just pure sweetness all the time. It's pure sweetness, like what life is all about, you know?